Hello everyone, I'd like to share with you a few trades posted on Tuesday, 4th of April 2023. These trades were shared by MG, who's trading Dow Jones Industrial Average in form of CFD. As you see, the macro chart of one hour is showing the downtrend, but testing the level of support and the price got rejected. And it's in sideways that you can see in five minute chart that it was going down at the beginning. Uh, so the downside of the channel using a one minute trading chart was sell shorted and this trade was managed and closed with exit strategy number one with profit and then when the channel broke up and the uh, upswing was formed again based on algo one to five you find another good entry here and entered here and exit with exit strategy number one and close this one also with profit so thank you MG for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades were shared by Jan, our global instructor who's trading NASDAQ futures. And as you see, the macro is in downtrend and it's reached an area that shows very high volatility at 10 o'clock due to the news release. And as you see, after finishing up the news and the volatility calmed down and this pullback got completed, there was a a return of sellers so he waited for the sellers to come back and these swings on the one minute chart was traded sell short mostly and you can see that using 10 second trading chart he identified pullbacks and entry based on algo one to five and entered multiple position several times and exit with profit so the result of these trades for the day was profit factor of about four and 68% average mean rate, 75% from sell short that mainly was taken. With the average win to loss ratio of 1.87, and the largest winning trade was 110, and the largest losing trade was also 100. So, thank you, Yan, for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades are those I have taken at the beginning of New York market session, and the video with explanation was sent to students yesterday. So I'm going to replay the video here for you. Hello everyone. I'd like to share with you my trades taken on Tuesday, 4th of April, 2023. These trades were taken on NASDAQ futures in form of E-mini and micro E-mini NASDAQ. Uh, if we look at the macro charts on a daily, uh, after several day of bullish moves, there was a sideway yesterday and also today. So on one hour macro chart, we see that price broke during Asian session and Globex and reached as high as 13,350 on NASDAQ, but couldn't hold and the price got rejected. So when the market opened, uh, start selling. Uh, let's look at the five minute macro here started to sell. It tested this point of control around 13,230 got rejected and went up so this wave of uptrend was taken there was also uh, some news so I waited for this news to clear the volatility and after 10 o'clock news release you can see it here multiple news uh, market again retested this level and it was kind of sideways finally broke this level and it started to go down so i took uh, during the short wave some uh, short uh, positions and also took long position this wave around 10 and uh, you see it here again short again long and it became very narrow range so i stopped trading the result of these trades were copied by copy trader by different ratio to different Apex uh, trader funding accounts. And the result is showing average profit factor of 1.37. And we had 76% win, mostly from long side, uh, about 78%. And the short size was losing. And the average win to loss ratio was 0.43. And the largest winning trade was 390 and the largest losing trade was $1,000. So hope this trace taken by the PAD system with order flow confirmation is useful for you. And let us know if you have any questions. 
Have a wonderful day.